Welcome back. This is an Alex homework uh, video on writing a chemical formula given a molecular model. This is simple after you get a hang of it, but there are a lot of rules. If you don't know anything at all about how to name something, there are rules to follow. This is a molecule, a drawn molecule, where you've got a sulfur atom connected to a carbon atom. The carbon is connected to three hydrogen atoms. Now on your computer, this will be able to slide around and you can see this three-dimensionally. And then the sulfur atom is also attached to a hydrogen. Okay, so you have a total of four hydrogens, one carbon and one sulfur. And they're asked to give you a chemical formula for the molecule. Okay, so first of all, you're going to need the symbols of these elements. So carbon is C, capital C. Hydrogen is capital H. These are only one uh, letter, not two. Uh, the other one you need is sulfur. That's S. Um, and that's all, right? Sulfur, carbon, and hydrogen. Okay. So some of the rules. Uh, when you look at the periodic table, you're going to see that sulfur is in group six. Okay. Sulfur is in group six. Carbon is in group four. So you are going to put carbon before you write sulfur. Okay, so carbon is before you get to sulfur. Um, usually you would put anything in group one first and then group two second, and it just works that way, three, third. Okay, if you have all of those different ones, you would just start at the left and to work to the right. Hydrogen is very weird. Hydrogen comes after everything except group six and seven. Okay, so if you have a group six, this is a group six on the periodic table, this is a group four. Hydrogen's normally, it's in, in the periodic tables in group one, but hydrogen in a chemical compound comes before groups six and seven. Okay, the other rule is if you have two elements in the same column, Whichever one is lower in the periodic table comes first. So if you have a choice where there's, they're in the same group, one the lower one comes before the one that's towards the top. Okay. So with all of that, you're going to do four first. So this is carbon. And there's one carbon, so we're not going to write the number one. The subscripts tell me how many of these there are. So if it's one, you just ignore it and just call it C. Okay. Um, Group six is sulfur, so it's going to be last because hydrogen is going to come before group six. So the next one that you're going to write is hydrogen. And we have one, two, three, four hydrogens. So I'm going to give you a subscript four for that hydrogen. And then, and finally, you have S, sulfur. Okay, so CH4S. And then we'll talk later about what these are called. There's names that are attached to all of these, and I uh, don't want to give you too much too soon. But this is, uh, this is how you do this, and you may need a little bit of practice doing these before it becomes easy. Okay, thanks.